Local doctors say they're seeing a high rate of hospital readmissions among COVID-19 patients. 12 News reporter Courtney Carter has the details on why recovering patients are finding themselves right back in the hospital. Courtney. Rhode Island Emergency Department say due to the complicated nature of the virus, many patients that find themselves feeling better end up right back in the hospital days later. The Rhode Island Department of Health reports the statewide hospital readmission rate is nearly 8% for COVID-19 patients. In multiple interviews conducted by 12 News with emergency care doctors, estimates seeing about 10%. We're seeing a phenomenon in this second wave. Patients will be discharged from the hospital and two to three to a week to 10 days later, need to come back to the hospital. Dr. Otis Warren, Rhode Island president of the American College of Emergency Physicians says, one reason for this is due to the nature of the virus. COVID-19 will often hit a person with somewhat mild symptoms, but the virus can sometimes take a quick turn for the worse. The other thing we're seeing is we're seeing a lot of embolisms, so pulmonary embolisms or thrombotic complications that can happen sometimes two weeks after the hospitalization that when they leave the hospital that this delicate balance kind of falls apart. He says treatment in the hospital is also far better than what's available to people at home. I and mean, when patients are hospitalized with COVID, they're getting a cocktail of different medications that includes a corticosteroid and remdesivir and they improve um, for the most part. Um, but then when they're out of the hospital, those medicines are no longer given. The state's largest hospital group, Lifespan, is starting a new program today to try to help readmission rates. Patients at risk of being readmitted are being sent home with a COVID care kit and instructions on how to report symptoms. I'm Courtney Carter, 12 News. Thank you, Courtney. An update on a 